This tool is called Tom's Strong Lists because like strength training in the gym, if you only use lists once a week, you won't see any results. You need to be using them consistently through the week. And much like strength training, if you do three or more sessions, you actually see the results there. You'll get progression in strength. So the same with lists. If you can, using them every day is great. Keep you focused on the tasks in hand. And for sleep, if you're able to sit down and write out the thoughts or worries that are on your mind and then apply a realistic date and time that you can take action on that, that thing. So if perhaps at 1am in the morning I am restless, my mind is whirring and perhaps I am thinking about uh, something I need to do for work. Uh, there's a project on, I just realise that I need to do this thing. Obviously 1am, I'm not going to be able to do anything at that time. But I can get up, I can write on my list what I need to do and when I'm going to take action on it. So it could be the next day or it could be the day after. Just give yourself a realistic date. And then the next step is to be able to put that to one side to help you to go back to sleep but then to actually take action on the date and time that you set. And rather than trying to complete the task, you're actually going to dedicate 10 to 15 minutes of time just to work at that task. And that's because rather than trying to think about the whole, we're trying to break it down into small chunks, make it easily accessible to, to take action on. So 10 to 15 minutes, and once you've done that, just to take a few minutes, just to um, recognize that you've been successful. You've actually taken that task that your mind was worrying about and you've taken action on it. And if you can on your list, in a different colored pen, just writing out each time you spend time um, on that thing. So perhaps one day you do 10 minutes, the next you do 15, the third day you do you know, 20, whatever it might be. Uh, and then the task is complete, but you can see that you're taking action and progressing. Rather than being hamstrung by any sort of fear or anxiety about a much bigger task, you're just going, right, I'm just gonna do 10 to 15 minutes. That's easy, I can do that. And you're telling your brain that you're taking action so it doesn't need to keep you awake at night. And then also you can see that you're making progress and working towards the completion of whatever it is that is worrying you. So give that a go. And um, yeah, just using pen and paper or your phone just to note down those tasks and take consistent action on them.